So first thing, Nick, I want to talk to you. First of all, what are you doing now? You, you said you had Austin P. Uh, yes, I'm um, assisting with the uh, linebackers and defensive line. Uh, so I'm enjoying that. Now, what's different about that as opposed to college, the NFL game? Obviously, recruiting. Is Absolutely. Different. So, what's been the biggest adjustment for you? I think the recruiting aspect of it and checking classes. Um, you're dealing with you know young men coming out of high school, and and so I think that's the biggest difference. But football is football from the coaching aspect. You know, it's a, it's a different scheme uh, that I'm not used to, and I'm working with the linebackers. I've never coached linebackers before, so uh, but I know ball, so it's it's been a kind of an easy adjustment. Now, um, you said it's laid back. Now, how, how different is – what do you mean by laid back? I've never I think, heard that used I before. think for me, you know, you know, I th- I, the NFL can, can bring a lot of stress. Uh, coaching can bring a lot of stress in general, but there's levels of stress, you know. Uh, uh, we had a, a great environment. I was lucky to be able to work, you know, on the malarkey uh, in Tennessee because mm-hmm. um, he made it a fun environment. Um, but there's always still pressure to want your guys perform on Sundays. And the same goes here, you know, but it's that, that level of stress is not as high. Um, but, you know, we got a really good team at Austin P. got a great young coaching staff, great young head coach in uh, Will Healy. And uh, it's going to be some good, good things to come moving forward. I'm excited about it. got some, a lot of talent there, and uh, we're going to do some good things. Now, I know you work at Austin P. and that's who you're loyal to. That's yeah. too, you know. But if the opportunity ever came up, would you? If Dabo said, "Hey, Nick, we," I mean, I'm there. That's that's <laughs> that's a no-brainer, you know. And have an opportunity to come back, uh, that would be a, a dream come true. I would be more than happy uh, to come back to Clemson uh, when given an opportunity. But you know, Coach Sweeney has done a really good job uh, since he's been there tremendously, and the coaching staff is awesome. And uh, had an opportunity to spend some time with them a couple of weeks ago, and the facilities are. Immaculate, and the best in the nation, and uh, but uh, yeah, that's home for me. You know, given opportunity, absolutely. Um, so you talk about being home and all. What are your thoughts of that facility, though? I mean, as you walk through it now, compared Ooh, to when you played, man. You know, <laughs> I just saw it about a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I didn't want to go online to ruin, you know, that awe experience that I would would have when I first walked in there. And so I, I got there, and I was just—it's just amazing. Uh, nothing I've ever seen in my life. And uh, I've been in a lot of different facilities in the country, and there's nothing that compares to that. Uh, it's, it's, it's hard to explain with words, to be honest with you. Um, but, you know, you know, you win football games, and, you know, things can happen like that for you. You can build, you know, the best facility in the world. Is it, you know, compare it to your time in the NFL? I, I, mean, I imagine it's better than NFL. I, I was told, anyway, it was better than some oh, Absolutely. NFL it's better than any NFL facility in the league, period. Uh, wow. There's nothing that will ever come compared to that. Um, they, they put a lot of uh, time and money into that facility. Uh, and the NFL is a little different. Most of the time and money is going into the players' pockets. It's a little different world, but uh, there's nothing that compares to And I'm talking about from the, from the, the facilities, the locker room, uh, even the training facilities, training room facilities, the fields, the indoor facility. Uh, it's just it's out of this world. Now, you played two Super Bowls, 1-1. To see Clemson win a national championship, yeah. obviously winning the Super Bowl was probably your number one thing. But right. what was that like as a Clemson alum to watch oh, man, them win the was, national title? It, it was amazing for me. Uh, I watched the game. I didn't have an opportunity to be there. But I watched the game at a, uh, at a restaurant uh, in uh, slash bar in uh, Nashville. Yeah. And there were probably 80 uh, Alabama fans and about five people that were rooting for Clemson. And I think the other four was rooting for Clemson because I was rooting for Clemson. <laughs> and I really showed my butt. I was celebrating as if I was there. It was the most uh, amazing moment for me. Uh, you know, them winning it all was it was winning it all for me as well. And if you would have been there and saw me, you would have thought that I won it all myself. <laughs> but uh, just very proud of what the program has done. And, and uh, it's looking forward to big things coming up this upcoming season.